from in the real crunch, the burst of energy. This what happened. And then what happened? This one. This movement. So once you punch you, you block him, you grab the hand, and there you go. So you hit him it's for self-defense. So now that means uh, from, from that point, okay, now we have the big circle, the big one yun gong combination of circle. Yeah. That means when I move, okay, yeah. So I just do simple movements. Okay, now from, from this way, like if I do this, hello everyone. So it's a circle, isn't it? It's a circle. Okay, yeah. Now, also, all right, okay, this, this is also a circle, backward and forward. Okay, now this one, left and right, but also a rising and sinking, isn't it? Rising and sinking, up and down. Okay, so from here, this one is the same, you know. So from here, if, if you see me, shall we say, if you see me uh, in the park, I'll, I'm, I'm training. Like this. <laughs> it's very slow, time. Time is the factor, all right? What's it for? What are those movements for? Don't you want to know a bit more? No? Instead of just, yeah, yeah, it's good, good for help. I know it's good for help. How? Why? Five minutes. Thank you, yeah? So these are the things that from the university level, that's how we look at things. We're not just looking at superficially, we want to look at, you know, the, the source of the knowledge, where it come from, thousands of thousand years of experience coming down. Now, so this movement, right? So if I do this, right? Isn't that true? It's like a circle. Yeah, okay. Now, speed wide now, I can do it faster now. So, but from in the real crunch, the burst of energy, <laughs> This what happened, see? This, this circle, right? It's a block, it's a seize. Grab your hand, somebody punch you girls, <laughs> do this, all right? And then what happened? This one, this movement. So once you punch you, you block him, you grab the hand and there you go. So you hit him, it's for self-defense. So see, a simple, lines of movements of circular movement to straight line movements zero one zero circular one chinese one is horizontal straight lines and you're creating a self defense movement so it's already there just a matter of you training how you're the burst of energy right build up all your ligaments so that's why not to bulk a muscle, girls. You wouldn't like, you wouldn't like to bulk a muscle. You don't need to, but you have ligaments. We all have ligaments, okay. So that's why from the martial side is very important. That's a connect my mind and body as well, isn't it? Because if you just go like this, you don't know what you're doing. It's not connecting, isn't it? Your body just move around. So you, what about your mind? How are you going to connect your mind and body? Okay, yeah. So. That is why it's very, very important. And the people didn't know that, oh, yeah, mind, mind, consciousness, or consciousness. Of course, it's consciousness, or consciousness. These are conscious, conscious routines. Your mind is telling your body what to do. So if you can call it the yang side, 
but also the mind can tell me to relax. And after times, oh, I relax. Yeah, they're completely different thing, opposite thing. But if you relax, you want to relax the body or you only relax the mind. So you say, oh, relax the mind. So how are you doing? Close your eyes. And that, that's how you react to relax the body, isn't it? Come on, be serious. Huh? Is that how you relax your mind? So that means in 3,000 years ago, John Zhu already said it, right? The mind, you can focus, you focus concentration to tell your body what to do. Now, very simple. I can give you a quick, very quick, uh, uh, what's the name, uh, test. Sit there, don't move, use your mind. Think about your big toe, your right big toe. Okay, yeah, move that. Now, you can move it. Split seconds, the minute your mind hit the toe, the toe can move. Now, what about the left toe, the little toe? Move your left little toe straight away. See, even that, that distance from here, your mind, the brain, you're commanding that strip of muscle all the way down to the foot. Within split second, you can tell them what to do. So is it not concentration? Or you can use the word meditation. But the word meditation has become completely misinterpreted and misused. Every time you talk about meditation, it's, oh, yeah. you drift into the subconsciousness of the universe. Sorry, I am stupid. I don't know universe has consciousness and subconsciousness. Okay, so think about that. So you have to accept it, you know, if it doesn't make sense. Do you still want to learn and still want to train that way? The thing that you don't know? It would be a waste of time. So very, very important. So that means the mind is telling you either you relax or you concentrate to do certain things. So that's the yin and the yang again. Okay. So that's why you have to be very, very understand. And from that's, that's from the martial side. And now from the health, the health exercise wise, how? Small circle. So what do you mean by small circle? That means... Now we have the uh, Taoist medicine. We talk about the heavenly pillar. So what is heavenly pillar? That's a pillar supporting the heaven. That's how important it is. If the pillar collapsed, the entire heaven will crushing down and there will be disasters everywhere, isn't it? So that's how important the heavenly pillar is. So if we use that principle and put it into our human, so what, where is the heavenly pillar of the human body? Your spine. Your spine is connecting the boss, the brain, and the body, mind and the body, all through this. It's like your high street. You receive signal, chi we call, or energy, right? Or all kind of biological signal, or neurological signal, or even muscular skeletal signal. So it's telling the, the, that kind of chi or that energy going through that spinal, that is spinal, spinal cord, and end up with telling the, the brain about 14 organs or how are their health status. And then the, the brain, right? Or your mind, if you want to use the word, okay? Process, uh, all, the, all the signal coming through, all the chi, energy, frequency, doesn't matter. Don't argue about name. It's only <laughs> ignorant people using the name game arguing about it. So at the end of the day is the transmissions of messages. The body transmitted to the to your mind to the brain, and then the brain receiving it, and the brain tell, you know, sending it all the way back down to all the different organs to adjust, right? To regulate regulate the hormones, to regulate the health status of your twelve major organs. This is what, right? Self healing is all about. So when the vertebrae have calcium deposit and they don't move. They don't move, okay? We're talking about movement, haven't we? Yeah, from the health movement, the movement. So inside is hollow. There are, from the neurological side, there are 31 pair of spinal nerves. So I'm using this as a little example, right? 31, so we stack upon each other. But the brain cannot tell the bone. The bone doesn't move, okay? Yeah, so that means you have the vertebrae housing this 31 pair of spinal nerves and neurological. Uh, stuff, isn't it? And also from the Chinese side, we got Duma, Rumma, and Zuma. These are the meridian. Okay. Yeah. We call it microcosmic path. Right. So signals ascending, 
picking up from the entire body, sending through this heavenly pillar to the brain and the brain sending it all the way back down as a cycle of communications. So these are what qi, you call it qi gong today. 4,000 years ago with records, uh, the ancient Chinese called it xing qi su, moving of energy. So that means you're moving your biological energy, you're moving, regulating your neurological energy, which is obviously all the nerve endings, is firing with electrics, okay? Because we are humans of electric, you know, we elect, yeah, electromagnetic fields we have. And, and also you have the muscular, skeletal, right? Because they are energy when you're exercising it. So these are xing qi su, moving of energy. So if you don't understand that, oh, why? Why bother training things that you don't understand? It's a waste of time, isn't it? True. So these structures are housed and protected by a huge pillar, muscular pillar. Okay. And that is where we call semispinal erector. And then now the five essences comes in. Okay. Small movement, left and right, up and down, backward and forward. So all the movement, each movement from the internal in our training, we are looking at moving our spine. So if you don't understand that, so, oh yeah, I'm doing health. Yeah, I'm doing health. Yeah, I know we're doing health, but you're only moving this joint. Oh, I see you moving your, if you, can you move your spine? So if you don't move your spine, how are you gonna stimulate, right? The signal, the nerves, right? Or the energy or the chi. Okay, yeah, to connecting the brain. So the brain releases the natural body medicine to regulate your health. So that is why it's so important you must understand a little bit more of that. Okay, yeah. So that's a small circle. Okay, yeah. All right, marketplace. Finally, I'm just gonna do a few movements. 